You know, I'm Jewish. I, I don't know the New Testament all that well. But I do know Matthew. Truly I tell you, whatever you did for one of the least of my brethren, you did for me. I went to a union hall not long ago, building trades, a carpenter came up to me. Big, strong guy, rough hands, big calloused hands. Tears in his eyes. He's gotten just a little bit of work here and there over the last 18 months. He said to me, I never took unemployment insurance before. I hate it. But if it weren't for unemployment insurance, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be in my house. Making tough choices means doing one thing and not another. And right now, we are faced with that choice. If we can't agree to help people like that carpenter and his family by continuing emergency unemployment benefits, how can we live with ourselves? How can we think that we're doing our jobs? The choice before us is clear this holiday season. Lend a hand to those who simply can't get by without the help. Or give $100,000 in average tax cuts to people making over a million dollars. Where are our values? What are we doing here? It's almost Christmas. We'll be leaving here to go spend time with our families, We've got jobs, we've got great jobs. I think this is the greatest job trying to make people's lives better back in Minnesota. That's my job. That's my job. So I asked my colleagues, what are we doing here? Thank you, Mr. President. Hold it right there. The Republicans lie. They want to see you dead. They'd rather make money off your dead corpse. They kind of like it when that woman has cancer and they don't have anything for her. That's how the insurance companies make money, by denying the coverage. My God, Democrats, what's wrong with you? You can't deal with these people at all.